me, and today is going to be a really quick video about me reading through Instagram ad comments. So you know sometimes when you're scrolling infinitely through your timeline and recommended of everything on Instagram and you just can't find anything, well sometimes you get some sponsored ads. So I thought, hmm, what about the comments in the ads? And that's what today's video is. That's it. Enjoy. Alright, so this first comment is from a sponsored post by Moog Parts. Now, the first and only comment on that ad post. <sighs> now, the next one struck me as odd because it was a post by Adobe Photoshop. Now, usually that's normal and people really like to comment about the price, but this one little comment caught my eye. It said, don't look up the seven stages of a serial killer and don't look at the second one. And what does that even... This is not going well. This next comment came from a post from Old and New, and I think it was about making pancakes and all this baking stuff that you want to buy. But this one person just decided to comment, hot off the fiddle griddle with a pancake emoji, and then just some, some fiddle, some fiddling. Now what the heck is a fiddle griddle, you may ask? I don't know, look it up yourself. And then the next two comments on this kind of got me confused because one person was asking for the song, which makes me believe that maybe the song is good. But then immediately the person after commented that the song is awful. So which is it? Now the next comment I got was from an ad from Carbon Bargain, I believe, and it was about them selling steering wheels. One person mysteriously just commented Benz question mark, which I believe to be the Mercedes Benz. And the company actually responded with just, yes, we can. Yes, we can what? Now the other comment on this post also had been confused because it asked a old ship related question, which went along the lines of, can I use this on my 1864 Brigantine with three masts, four decks, and 50 cannons? And they actually responded with Tess. How do you misspell yes? Another ad I was bound to run into while scrolling through my infinite feed was a Bell Canada ad. And in the comments, I got this one saying, this is the worst ISP I've ever dealt with. Now the comment itself is not particularly funny, but the funny part stems from the fact that it, it's Arnold Schwarzenegger <laughs> saying this. The other comment on this post that I found particularly interesting was one person commented not once, but twice. That's gangsta. Now, that would just be fine, but this man had the sickest looking cowboy hat ever. I'm sorry if I'm revealing your face or anything, but that's a cool looking cowboy hat. The next ad I got was for CIBC Banking, and it simply said these four simple words, share more with family. Only one comment responded, only one. And it said, did you say family? While continuing to scrolling through, I got another ad for Food Basics, and only one comment was in there. Just one. All it said was, awesome! Exclamation point. What's awesome? Who knows? The next sponsored post I ran into was an O. Henry's ad, of course, you know, the candy bar. And I was seeing generally the same thing. There was two comments saying, lame, uh, boring ad, meh. And then there was the kid from Shrek 4 saying, Eat the roar. That's so stupid. Moving on, I got an ad for my own cereal, of course, uh, Jordan's cereal, where one of the hashtags in the bottom was granola and go, because I guess they were advertising a new granola bar. Out of, I was seeing throughout the comments a majority of hashtag granola and go. One man, one man alone, commented hashtag space, making the hashtag null and void, granola. And that wouldn't even be that bad. But the thing is, granola is spelt wrong. How do you spell granola wrong? He spelt it granola, uh. The next sponsored post I got was for MDA space. And the only comment on there read out as, how can you go to space when it's been proven to not exist? Last time I checked, it's still there. Keep up with the land-based communications, I guess. Adoy, laughing, laughing, crying face emoji. 
Another post I received was for Unreal Engine where they were advertising whether they're new updates or whatever. But one of the top comments simply read out as, I drew a funky lizard man on MS Paint one time. Period. I ate a bagel. Cool story. But what does it have to do with Unreal Engine? The second last ad I received was actually not an ad. It was actually just the official Home Depot page. And it was a cute little dog doing some stuff with a little tool belt. That's adorable. Can you guess what the comment is? I bet you can't guess. A dog doing something mundane and cool? Hmm, what's the dog doing, I guess? What the dog do? What is the dog doing? What the dog doing? Now the last ad I got, I got a few of these, but it was for Cineplex Canada, you know, the movie company. And it was basically advertising their new popcorn bag. In the comments, there were no comments. It was really sad. But then one hero stepped up to the plate to make it all better for us and commented, Boss Baby 2. And what ensued was the whole Wikipedia page for the description of Boss Baby 2. What kind of loser, what kind of idiot would do this? This is awful. I don't agree with this. Also, it was me who commented it. 